I'm down at the Ottawa airport. I seem to spend a lot of time here lately. I'm in a cargo hangar where they're getting a bunch of hockey gear ready here to go up north. It's part of a charity called Project North, and it's attracted some, uh, well, a little bit of celebrity here today as they get ready to send the gear north for kids to play. Uh, Lorene Harper, the Prime Minister's wife, dropping by. So why do you support this charity? What made you decide to get behind Project North? Well, we love hockey. My whole family loves hockey. We love to watch it. And when my son was small, he loved to play it. And we know how expensive it is. And especially if anybody's been to Northern Canada, they know how much everything costs so much up there. And uh, hockey equipment is a luxury. And so this way, uh, we have all our sponsors. We get thousands and th tens of thousands of dollars worth of equipment donated. We take it up north and uh, give it out to the kids so they have uh, community-wide, um, they share it. And uh, we have thousands of kids up north getting to play Canada's game. It's fantastic. Have you, I know your husband goes up north every year. Have you had a chance to go up and, and see the end result anywhere? No, but we, I think we want to plan on it. So I've been working in this charity for three or four years now, and we're really excited. So I would like to actually share it with, with my husband. So hopefully we'll end up doing that this summer. All right. Any other thoughts on uh, on Project North that, uh, that people should know about? No. Well, people should just go to our website, and they can donate. They can buy just a pair of skates. You can see our website. It shows how expensive it is. So you can buy a neck guard for about $20. You can buy all the way up to a whole goalie equipment bag. So uh, we put it together so people can either buy a whole bag or just pieces. And uh, we would just love their love their donations to make a lot of the kids up, up north uh, get to play Canada's game. All right, thanks. So just keep looking right here. Is this where you say work? Michelle Valberg is president of Project North. How did you decide that this was a, a charity that needed to be put together? I was visiting the Arctic as a photographer and I noticed that a lot of the communities that I was seeing had access to wonderful recreation centers and they had hockey rinks but they didn't have access to the hockey equipment. When you go into the stores and you actually see a two liter carton of milk cost $18, you can imagine how much it would cost to get hockey equipment up there. So I, sport is important to me and I think it's important to everybody and to give this uh, ability, this access to hockey equipment to the kids, I just thought it was a nice way to give back, especially since I was there photographing and, and getting from them, you know, about their like learning from them. Um, I wanted to give something back. So it was a perfect opportunity to start this project. So you work with uh, a lot of individual donors mm -hmm. and a lot of corporate sponsors to put this together. Mm -hmm. And without the sponsors, as you know, you can't get very far, especially with the cost of shipping. So First Air is our wonderful shipping sponsor. We have the NHLPA, the Goals and Dreams Fund, that have supplied us with hockey equipment throughout the years. We also are able to buy equipment directly from them. Uh, and uh, uh, companies like Scotiabank and Cot North, all these companies have come together. Nikon has given us uh, cameras to bring up on this trip to Arctic Bay, so we're excited about that. I uh, can uh, actually teach the kids some, some photography and leave them with something so they're able to do some photography on their own when I'm not there. Get some great shots of themselves playing hockey. Exactly. Isn't uh, that great? Well, let's take a look at yeah. the gear because this is shiny I new know, gear. Brand new. I mean, um, isn't that incredible? When you see it coming out of the bag and you see these brand new hockey equipment. Uh, so this is real Bauer skates. Yeah. These have not been used. No, they're, everything's brand new and it's from from top to bottom. It's everything. It's even including neck guards and jerseys and it's got skates and shoulder and, pads. A jersey and, from the NHL Players Association. Yeah, the Goals and Dreams Fund is the, what we're supplied. Uh, uh, this equipment is coming from the NHLPA Goals and Dreams Fund. So it's thanks to the players, the NHL players, that we're able to do this as well. And you've had players go up with you in the past. Yes, we had Kyle Quincy come up to Pond Inlet, and uh, this year we were bringing up Eric Branson, but unfortunately, or fortunately for him, he was named to the World Championships. So we have his brother Alex joining us, and we're just presently looking for another player to hopefully come up and get on the on the ice with the kids and give them some coaching. And uh, we've got a couple other minor hockey coaches coming up with us too. So we're able to not just deliver, but get on the ice with them and actually, you know, give them some uh, tips and pointers. All right, so there's about $25,000 worth of hockey gear mm -hmm. here, I'm mm -hmm. told. Mm -hmm. This will be going up over the next few weeks, yes. and then you go up and, and distribute it and, and, and have an event when? Uh, May 7th to 11th is our trip to Arctic Bay, so we're look, really, really looking forward to that, and uh, we'll be presenting the, the hockey equipment and getting on the ice with them as well. So we'll be doing some skating and some, uh, some playing, and, and uh, we'll be able to see firsthand uh, these kids in this equipment. I was speaking with Mrs. Harper, and she was describing that people can still all year go and uh, and 
and donate. You can just buy a, a pair of skates or a pair of shin pads. Yeah, so it, uh, gear up on our projectnorth.ca website. People can go if they don't have uh, enough money to buy a full bag, they can buy a shin pad or they can buy a pair of skates. They can buy anything that they want to to help fill a bag and get it back up to the uh, to the Arctic. All right, thanks so much, and uh, we Thank will continue you. to watch this project, and we'll bring you more once they're up there. I don't know. I don't know if I'll go, but we'll definitely oh. bring you more from that story when it happens. In the meantime, check out projectnorth.ca.